Watching Skylar and Madison's relationship over the past two plus years has been incredible. Seeing the way you two have grown together and the love that you two have for each other is something that everybody wants in life. As someone who has loved Madison for all of this time, thank you, Skylar, for loving my friend as well. Shaking, guys. Just, just here. Just. You like it? I love it. I love all, everything about it. Skylar and I grew up about a four-minute bike ride through the shortcut away. We would make that bike ride every day, most of the time, multiple times a day, back and forth from house to house finding different things to keep us entertained. The biggest thing we had in common were sports. We grew up playing baseball together on our, uh, on our summer baseball team and then through high school. Through that, I learned one major thing about Skylar. He's the best teammate you could ever have. He's reliable. If this guy says he'll be there, he'll be there. If he's got your back, he's got your back. I can say when I was pitching, all I wanted was a fly ball anywhere near center field because as most of us in this room know, two thirds of our earth are covered in water. The other third's covered by Skylar Yates. Always remember to carpe diem, seize the day. Enjoy the little moments, support one another through the challenges, and cherish the love you share. Live every day to its fullest, and appreciate every second together. Madison, you, you have the best teammate I've ever seen. And you guys have one of the strongest teams I've ever seen. And I can't wait to continue rooting on your team for years to come. I love both you guys. Congratulations. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here in the presence of God, family, and friends to witness a joyous occasion the union of Madison and Schuyler in holy matrimony. Well, we made it. <laughs> I truly thought that this day would never come. You are the full package. You are beautiful, smart, funny, a great cook, and the best dog mom the girls could ask for. Over the past couple years, you have become my best friend, teammate, and the love of my life. The way you love me is unlike anything I have ever known. You believe in me, you motivate me, and you inspire me. With you, I feel safe, loved, accepted, and appreciated. I promise to love you and take care of you in sickness and illness, whatever WebMD can find, until you are back to full health. <laughs> <laughs> I vow to do all the jobs around the house that you don't want to do. <laughs> I promise to make you laugh and smile every day. I vow to always push you to be the best person that you can be, as you have always done for me. But most importantly, I vow to never stop loving you. I give you my heart. I know that together we can accomplish anything. I promise to keep our love fun, exciting, and full of adventure. I promise to always help you find things, even when they are sitting directly in front of you. And most importantly, I promise to bake your favorite Reese Cheesecake Brownies every July 16th, as for as long as I am capable of doing so. But really, 
I promise to be the best wife I possibly can be and your best friend. Today, tomorrow, always and forever. I've called you my coworker, my boyfriend, my fiance. And now I vow to love you forever as I get to call you my husband. From this day forward and all the days of my life. By the power vested in me, by the state of Ohio and the presence of God and the witnesses of friends and family, it is my great privilege to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Let's raise our glasses high to Madison and Schuyler. May your life be filled with endless love, boundless joy, and countless memories. Here's to a future as bright and beautiful as both your hearts. Cheers. Cheers.